Back, Pritam ahead, left wing side. Back of the blue line, Adamek will play it back inside of the Warriors zone. Jackson Krill try to make his way in, but Jack Pritam there for that. Pritam below the goal line, trying to start his way up the right side. Will drop it back off. Caden Schottmeyer along the left wing, and Trey Osmus out through center with a pass that was intercepted. Krill takes it away and starts back into the right side. Fed it ahead. Shannon to the net. He scores! Two fifty-two into the opening period, Coquitlam has looked the better team in the early going, and the Express get the opening goal. It's Shannon who picks up his eighth of the year and gives Coquitlam a one-to-nothing lead. Shannon got fed the pass in front from the right side by Krill, and it's up and. Here's Vardy with it now. A long left point, a long shot to the front of the goal. Kicked off of Osmus. Loose in front, and Appleby steered it to the corner. Back up the boards. That will come. Left point, Oliver Gabrielson will work it down low. Bonkowski's centering attempt was knocked away by Osmus and played back out towards center where it's chipped ahead by Brennan Nelson. Racing after it, right wing circle in front for Hughes. He scores! Cal Hughes right in front on a nice setup. Up from Brennan Nelson in the right wing circle. It's goal number 20 for Hughes on the season. The third Warrior 20 goal scorer on the year. And West Kelowna's game, it's 1-1. Nelson able to chip that by the defense and make his way up the right side. Back along right point, Norland. Left side for Karan. He settles it. 40 seconds to go in the power play. Norland. Left side. Karan fakes the shot. Try to push it across the right side for Hughes. That was knocked away. Hughes left point with it now. Throws it down. Right circle. Back door. Pass in front. Wilson scores. Right at the front of the goal. It's put home. And I'm not sure if it was Trent Wilson or it's Jackson Kier Costas. Someone wants to lead the rush. We're not sure who. And with 16-27 to go in the second period, a power play goal for the Warriors gives them a lead. It's 2-1 West Kelowna. Karan was able to get that puck in the slot, sent it in front for Trent Wilson, and Wilson Appleby played a long left wing circle. Now back up to the blue line. Here's Ruben. Right wing side, a quick pass across. Garzona shot that went off a stick, and Manfrey will take it over right side. Blue line for Ruben. Ruben left wing. Here's Garzon. Back across. Ruben delaying right point. Threw it right circle. Manfrey to the net. He scores. Jake Manfrey, a power play goal. And a shot from the right circle that had eyes for the back of the net. Threw a screen Rorick Appleby. And it's the... Express who have tied the game 2-2. Ron will touch it along left wing out of the reach of Kier Costas. Back down inside of the Warriors zone. Garzon back for that as he tried to center in front. Brooks knocked it away. And the clock winding down and it will hit zeros. And this game needs more than 60 minutes. We're all tied up 2-2. We'll go to overtime here in Coquitlam with each team knotted up at 2-2. Two. No scoring in the third period between the two sides. We'll play on here in this overtime with no penalty coming on that play. Norland tried to free it up. Comes loose right circle. Lockberg had it poked away and a chance the other way. Jacob Bonkowski's in alone. Bonkowski to the backhand. Scores! Jacob Bonkowski, the overtime winner after the Warriors of the puck in the offensive zone lost the handle and Bonkowski goes in on a break, goes to the backhand and slides it past Rorick Appleby on the blocker side. Bonkowski gets the goal with 5.11 to go in overtime. Coquitlam wins it 3-2 the final score.